Now, the ISC squared code of ethics are not the only game in town. Let's take a look at the Computer Ethics Institute. They publish the Ten Commandments of Computer Ethics. We all know the basis of the Ten Commandments would be what Moses brought down from the mountain, and it has the same type of verbiage. Thou shalt not use a computer to harm other people. Thou shalt not interfere with other people's computer work. Thou shalt not snoop around in other people's computer files. Thou shalt not use a computer to steal. And thou shalt not use a computer to bear false witness. Those are the first five. Let's continue on with the next five. In addition, thou shalt not copy or use proprietary software for which you have not paid. I'm kind of wondering why they didn't say for which thou hath not paid. But, you know, they're changing the verbiage here a little bit. Number seven. Thou shalt not use other people's computer resources without authorization or proper compensation. Number eight, thou shalt not appropriate other people's intellectual output. Number nine, thou shalt think about the social consequences of the program you are writing or the system you are designing. And number ten, thou shalt always use a computer in ways that ensure consideration and respect for your fellow humans. Now, some of it can be a little tongue-in-cheek. But these are great commandments for us to live by with respect to computer ethics. They really lay out what's good and what's bad about using our computers.